Hey guys, so uh, if anyone owns a Sprinter van with a 3 liter OM642 or any Mercedes uh, with that engine set up, I uh, just wanted to show you kind of what the innards of uh, this look like. So I'm going to throw it on the vise. And so generally these fail um, by... Uh, there's a little valve in here held open by a spring. And if the valve tears... Are getting this house kind of tricky? Um, if the valve tears, then that is um, right here. So this is a little just rubber uh, valve. It flexes in and out with this spring. So um, when the turbo pulls pulls vacuum oh wrong way so this is this is connected this side is connected to the turbo side this is gonna push down and seal off and then it's gonna be open when not under boost when a, the turbo is not pulling vacuum a lot of times uh, the failure is actually on the opposite side it's usually here where this is allowing this is allowing um, this hole right here kind of expands. This is quite larger than the one I just replaced. Um, and it allows too much oil in. This seal can leak. If you have a leak coming off the back of your engine block, um, you can see this one's pretty squished flat. But it's a very simple system. Uh, you know, shame on Mercedes for not selling this part individually, but because it's so simple. Um, literally spring and this little valve. Make sure it's seated and I mean literally just a backing plate and a little uh, clamp that holds it on. So I'm gonna see how it does. Just kind of keep uh, tabs on if there's any excessive oil on mine. Um, I've considered doing a catch can, but um, at this point I think I'm gonna hold off. So, but yep. So anyways, if uh, anyone was wondering what one of these look like, that's it. Thank you.